taking you someplace extra special to fish. Where, Dad? Where? Through the time tunnel to the big misty sea, smack in the middle of the Cretaceous time period. Yeah! Hello there, Pteranodon family. Where to today? We're going fishing at the big misty sea. Well, reel me in and weigh me. You kids are lucky. That's some mighty fine fishing. All aboard! <laughs> <laughs> I'll zoom down to the water and catch a fish this big. Well, I'm going to swoop in and catch a fish as long as this bitch. Hey, buddy, sorry about all the flying and fishing talk. I know you can't fly. Oh, it's okay, Tiny. I love being a fish or fish spotter and eater. Hey, you know how we sometimes lift you up and fly you to the train station or the big pond? We could hold your arms and fly you over the water so you can fish too. Wow, would you guys really? Absolutely. Yay, I'm going to catch a fish this big. Uh, I have to work while you all fish. At least I won't run into the old Spinosaurus. The old what Oh, right. You kids have never been to the big misty sea before. You don't know about the old Spinosaurus. Whoa. Whoa. He's huge. One of the largest carnivores to ever roam the Earth. Look at that giant crest thingy on his back. Made up of big, sharp, pointy spikes. It's called a sail fin, and you'll get a better idea of how big he is if you run into him. If we run into him, how could we miss a guy that big? Well, the old Spinosaurus is a cranky old feller who wants to be left alone. Oh, fine with me. I'll leave him alone. He stands on two legs, like me. And look, he has three toed feet. I have a hypothesis. The old Spinosaurus is a theropod. Just like you. Yes, buddy, he sure is. <laughs> Good observation. But why does he hang out at the big misty sea? He must eat meat instead of fish. He's a theropod. Maybe he eats both. We can test your hypothesis if we see him. Oh, my, how time flies. <clears throat> time tunnel, time tunnel approaching. <laughs> in another part of the Cretaceous time period. Bye-bye, Tyrannodon family. Have fun fishing. Oh, and say hi to the old Spinosaurus if you see him. We will! Or I won't. Whoa, it's so foggy. Now I know why they call it the Big Misty Sea. With all this fog around, It'll be easy for that cranky old Spinosaurus to sneak up on us. Well, the conductor said he won't bother us if we don't bother him. Don't worry, just stick close to me. Good idea, Dad. Okay, Team Pteranodon, let's go catch us some fish. Ready to fly, buddy? Yeah, let's do it. Hang on, buddy. from here. Just kidding. I see fishies. Ready to scoop up a fish, buddy? Yeah. Time for lunch. Or is it brunch? Or maybe lunch fest? Dawn, pay attention. Dive! No fish that time. <laughs> do it again. Buddy, do you have to yell so loud? You're scaring the fish away. Sorry, Tiny. I can't help it. It just comes out. I'm getting tired, Dawn. Let's put Buddy down for a minute. Yeah. How about over there on that big, weird-looking rock? <sighs> That's hard work. <sighs> Sorry, Buddy. I think we have to fish without you for a while. That's okay. I'll be your spotter. I can see almost everything from up on this big rock. Look, it even has this nice frail thingy I can lean against. Hey! Dad! Shiny! I see a school of fish right below you! Jason! 
Hey, fish! Hi. You must be the Spinosaurus the conductor told us about. You must be the father of these trespassing kids. Keep them out of my sea. It's my sea, you see? We're sorry, sir. We didn't mean any harm. We thought you were a big rock. I'm really glad to meet you, Mr. Spinosaurus. I'm Buddy, and I'm a theropod, just like you. In case you haven't noticed, kid, we're nothing alike. Sure you are. You both walk on your two hind legs and have three toes. Yeah, but you are a little different from my hypothesis. Buddy needs an idea you can test. Big words from a little past. I thought you'd be a meat eater like the other theropods. I'm surprised to see you trying to catch fish. And I would have caught some fish if you'd been quieter. Sorry. But we're all sorry, sir. Shh. Don't move a muscle. Here he is. There who is? Oh, damn it! I almost had it! Well, you actually lost that one yourself. We didn't scare him over. Um, you almost had who? Oh, Chester, the big fish I've been after for years. Big he is. Huge! Huge? Even to you, Mr. the Old Spinosaurus? Yep. Biggest fish in the big misty sea. I aim to catch him one day. You'll see, I'll do it, for my name isn't the old Spinosaurus. And it is your name. Well, uh, good luck, sir. Uh, we'll leave you to your lifelong quest and just move... Wait a second, Dad. We can't go now. This is awesome. We just met a theropod who catches fish. Mister, will you teach me how to fish like you? Why? Well, you see, I'm a theropod, growing up in a pteranodon family. They're all super good at fishing. If you could teach me how to fish theropod style, I could catch fish like the rest of my family. Mm -hmm. I remember growing up with my family. Ma, Pa, my sister Tiny. Tiny? That's my name. Well, what do you know? I mean, so what? Please, Mr. Old Spinosaurus, sir. Teach Buddy how to fish and we'll never bother you again. Well, uh, if he'll get rid of you, pests, uh, I'll do it. Yes! Okay, we're in the water and standing real still. What next? What's next is we keep doing this. But we aren't doing anything. Look, kid, the secret to theropod fishing is to stand perfectly still so that the fish think you're just some old log or a rock. Like we thought you were a rock. And a theropod like you should have known better. Now hush and keep your eyes peeled. When the fish swim close, we scoop them up in our long theropod jaws. Got it. I think I know why the old Spinosaurus said he'd teach Buddy to fish. He knew he'd get some peace and quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Fly around a little. Better to reach that big spiky guy. Not too far, just overhead, Shiny. Ah, <sighs> that mean old dinosaur looks a lot smaller from up here. Huh? Hey, buddy. Hey, mister. A real big fish swimming your way. It's him. It's Kevin. <laughs> It. Never been so close in my life. Good eye, young lady. You and me almost got him using pteranodon and theropod fishing methods. Gee, well, thanks, sir. Glad to help. I caught one. I caught a fish. Theropod style. <laughs> Boy, the sun sure is heating up. Yep, you need one of these big old frills on your back. They stick up and catch the breeze. It helps to cool my body. And make shade for the rest of us. You sure aren't what I expected you to be, Mr. Spinosaurus. I hypothesized you would only eat meat, and I was so wrong. But I'm glad we stuck around to find out. I'm glad you stuck around too, buddy. And I have a hypothesis of my own. You can teach an old dinosaur a new fishing trick. <laughs> Whoa, I can't believe it. 
I think I actually smiled. <laughs> well, how was the fishing? Hooray! I learned how to fish their pod style. And guess who we met? One day, I'll catch Chester, or my name isn't the old Spinosaurus. <laughs> so you met the old guy. That's right. We made a new friend, and he's big. This big. <laughs> <laughs>